Hmm. Good morning. Gising na ang bebe natin, guys. Luto na rin yung kanyang pagkain. Yung aming fried rice lang natin. Yes, we'll have breakfast. Good morning. Say good morning to titas. Good morning. <laughs> okay, princess. She is now trying to sit down. <laughs> Nang siya lang mag-isa. Oh, come on. Oh! Mambo! You know when mommy's vlogging, ha? Mishka's radio. You wanna sit down? Come on. Come 
cảm ơn chị Đăng Hold mommy Sandra Cảm ơn Cảm ơn Ờ Mũ phụ này ăn ế Mẹ chị cả cả Who is sleepy? Meshka. <laughs> You're a big girl now, love, love. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Natutumba pa din. Mm. Mm. Nagbubugas ako ng pinggan yung yung aking kasama dito, guys. Nagaano, nagpo-push. <laughs> Mishka is pushing, pushing, pushing. Mishka is pushing something out. Ha, huh, princess. Luto ako pero umiiyak so kailangan kong laruin. Bihon, may natira pa kasi ako. Isa naman lang ito. Yung isa nil yung isa niluto ko ng birthday ko. Meron akong gulay. And yung aking nga manok hindi pa talaga na defrost. Umiiyak yan. Hindi na talaga ako makaka tuloy-tuloy uh, sa mga ginagawa ko. Kasi si Mishka umiiyak na. Hindi gaya dati nung maliit pa siya. Kahit ilagay ko lang siya sa kanyang rocker. Hindi yan umiiyak na yun. Sumisigaw pa. Pero pag binibigay ko naman sa... Pag binibigay ko sa kanya yung attention ko, may kinakausap ko siya, hindi siya umiiyak. Gusto niya lang talaga ng ano, na palagi ko siyang hinilalaro, kinakausap. Pag wala ako, grabe ito umiyak. 
Wait, are you crying? Mm. I ano na kasi quarter to eight Monday sa LPG. Ngayon pala ako na sa pagdulo. Hi. Hi. Tumali ko dong ako sa kanya ng konte. Iyak na yan si Sigaw. Mexica, Mexica, Mexica. Again today, Abhi got this kachori. This is kachori, this one. And samosa, and then jolly beef. Yung sweets. We'll have snacks for a while. Kasi meron na naman pasalubo. Ang daddy ni Mishka. That's why Mishka's dad is very slim. <laughs> because he doesn't like eating. Pero almost every day may dalaya pasalubo. <laughs> Hindi ko siya makakita kasi nakaano ko. What, Mishki? Not yet prepared. Uh, so if we will eat this, baka hindi lang kami kumain nung niluluto kong bacon. Uh huh? Mm -hmm. We're going to eat later. Okay. But I'll see if hindi ka mamutog nito. Check mo ka ng huli, huh? Their jalebi is really good. Jalebi, be the answer, yeah. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Sit down, sit down. You're rocking the foot. Sit down, sit down. Yeah, boy. You're rocking the boat. Sit down, sit down. You're rocking the boat. Sit down, sit down. You're rocking. <laughs> you wanna eat with mommy and daddy, love? Uy! She knows how to take off her, ano na ha? Head back. Today I have posted our video the this is house update yung bahay na pinapatayin namin doon sa Patna and maraming salamat sa inyong mga comments, mga messages. We really appreciate your ano, your best wishes sa aming pagpapatayo ng bahay. And may mga nag-comment din pala na malaki yung size ng bahay. Actually hindi talaga siya malaki. Hindi siya ganoon kalapat. Pahaba lang yung pahaba, yung length niya pahaba yung lote. Kaya mas mabuti talaga na may second floor, third floor kasi nga hindi ganun ka kalapat yung area. Maha mahaba lang siya, pero hindi siya yung siguro. How big is the lot, hon? Baby, from that sala up to your kitchen? 1,000 square feet. 1,000 square feet. So, yun. Kaya siya um, merong second floor, third floor. 
para if in case we are going to settle there, at least we have uh, area for me, for his parents, if in case yung aking sister-in-law, ganon. But if marentahan siya, then okay din, ba? And there are others, Galehan, who's asking if we are going to transfer in Patna to live in that house. Actually, as long as Abhi is working in his job, we cannot really stay permanently in one place. So, dito siya na-assign ngayon. We also don't know when he's going to get transferred or kung magsistay pa kami ba. Magsistay pa kami dito sa sa Bangalore. But one thing is really sure that we will only live permanently in Patna if Abhi is going to quit his job. <laughs> Are you? Mm -mm. That is also our um, like one of our plans. That's why Abhi wanted to retire early because we are also thinking of Mishka. Like in, in his current job, whenever they will transfer him, so of course me and Mishka will have to go with him. So if Mishka would be studying, kawawa naman siya, di ba? No, no. If she would be studying, so transferring to one school to another, it would be difficult for her. That's why we... Otherwise, they will have to get separated away. You will live in a different city. And I will just travel in weekend. I don't want you to like miss Misha's childhood because we are far from you. Yeah, me too. That's why. That's our goal. We wanted to finish our loan, get the house finish. And we can retire early. We can have business. So at least we will just stay in one place permanently, not this. Actually, this is good. Like, maybe for newly married people, Han, our setup, Bahan, like moving to one place to another, it's good, it's exciting. So at least you can see different places. You can travel in other parts of India. But once you already have children, like for us, we have already Mishka, we also have to consider her like schooling later in the future, diba? That's our goals in life, guys. <laughs> Hopefully, we can do that in the coming years, few years from now. Mm -hmm. That's our plans. I'm just waiting for my Bihon. And I ako ni Abhi ng bag because I have orders from Big Basket ng mga vegetables. He did not pick it up. No, I asked them. I don't know if it was raining. So they said inside. He said, sir, I can't find you. See if it's outside. Maybe they said inside or what. I don't know. So I can't find it. You know, sometimes instead of keeping it near the security guard, they're keeping this side only. In the car? Yeah. No, because if it's raining, the Maybe orders will also get wet. Mm -mm. That's why they're putting it there whenever it's Victorian, maybe. Are you going to eat tonight, huh? No, no, no. So, until tomorrow, na itong aming ulang. By the way, tomorrow is Raksha Bandhan. Wait, tomorrow is Raksha Bandhan! Mm -hmm. uh, advance happy Raksha Bandhan to everyone. And to him also. You tell them what is Raksha Bandhan, huh? Can you explain? <laughs> Raksha is the festival between brothers and sisters. The sister will have to put bracelet or gold rocky to um, their brothers. And the brother will also like promise that he will take care of his sister. He will protect her. Like that. Okay. Bihon natin itong mga 
in order ko sa big basket. Kanina pa to, yung schedule ko for, for delivery to is 3 to 5. Pero hindi ako bumaba kasi nga ayaw ko na ilabas ngayon si Mishka kasi may positive thing to sa kapila namin. Wait lang. Uh, tinapay. Sandwich bread. Maganda kasi sa big basket yung tinapay nila kasi malaki yung ano, size. Ano to? Sibuyas dahon. Ayan. And kinuha ko din kasi yung mga ano to eh, mga leaky vegetable. And then pak choy. Mura lang ito. Parang 20 plus lang ito. Ito, mura. Parang 4, 4 rupees lang yung ganito. Okay, ang mga na ako. Tapos, top ramen. Meron ako mga noodles, noodles dito eh. Kasi, pag ano kasi, pag tanghali. Pagkatapos ng mesh ka maligo and then uh, didede yan, only lunch kami. So, pagkatapos pa niyang dumede, depende pa kung hanggang kailan siya matapos. Minsan, umaabot ng malapit isang oras yung pagpapadede ko sa kanya. So, pagkatapos niyang dumede, tulog na siya. Tsaka pa lang ako makakapag-lunch and minsan, gutom na ako. Wala pa akong nalutong pagkain. So, mas okay na na. Meron ako noodles just in case. At so, bago kong order ito, chicken noodles. Itatry ko pa to. First time ko uh, umorder nito. Titingnan ko if malapit ba sa atin, sa lasa ng ating magi na chicken noodles. And then ito. Ito yung order ng last time ni Abby na crab flavor. Mas gusto ko to. Kaya umorder ako ng dalawa. Ito ay mga ano lang for emergency. Tapos Mayroon akong mushroom. Dalawa. Mushroom. 87. So, parang ano lang siya. 43.50. Tapos, umorder ako nito. Um, one liter na milk. Plano ko kasi magluto ng white pasta. So, okay, umorder din ako nito ng mushroom. Ayan. Tapos, eggplant. Lemon. Ang liliit ng lemon nila. Green paso. May nagsabi dati na pag green lime. Pag yellow, lemon. Ito, lemon. Ready. Carrots. Lemon ata ulit. Yeah, lemon ulit, lemon. Tapos. Ito. Ginger. Luya. Uh, sweet potato. Kamote. Para kay Mishka. Ay, hindi naman maganda yung binigay nila. Ano lang nila? O, pinap nila. Ito na ito pa. Para ito kay Mishka. And then, meron silang avocado. Silaw pa. Hindi pa siya ano. Ito. Dalawa. 174. Mahal yung avocado nila. Then, may akong butter. Uh, ang linis ni Abhi na heartbeat. And then, yung aking favorite drink na api feast. Tatlo. Yan yung aking order, guys. Ito na yung aking bihon, guys. Lutong-luto itong aking, ano, carrots. <laughs> kasi, ay, pag kumakain sa api, ayaw niya kasi ng, ano, yung crunchy pa. And ako din, okay din sa akin yung malambot na malambot talaga. So, ito yung aking hapunan with rice. Kain muna tayo, guys. Masarap siya. Nilagyan ko kasi ito ng ano, um, chicken cubes. Meron kasi ako nakita ng mga comment like regarding sa pag ng bahay. Mas mabuti na meron talagang sariling bahay kaysa mag-rent, mag ganun. Which is true naman. Mas maganda talaga na meron kayong sariling bahay or kami, meron kami sariling bahay na amin. Talaga, I guess sa mga bago lang dito, siguro hindi nila napanood yung mga videos kung saan na-mention ko yung Yung tinitirhan kasi namin na bahay na ito, hindi kasi namin shoulder ang pagrenta sa bahay na namin dito ngayon. Yung office ni Abhi yung nagbabayad nitong aming renta sa bahay. So, every month, yung payment for the rent directly na napumunta sa aming landlord from sa office nila ni Abhi. Wala na kaming pinoproblema every, every month na magbabayad kami sa aming landlord. Hindi. Yung office nila, directly na na uh, tinatransfer sa bank account ng aming landlord yung payment dito ng bahay. So, yung binabayaran ng talaga namin is uh, kuryente 
and water and maintenance dito which is ano lang naman maliit lang naman siya and yung renta sa bahay wala na kaming iniisip pa every month and then pag lilipat na naman kami magte-transfer kami kailangan namin ng movers and packers yung mga nagbabalot nitong mga gamit namin and then yung pag uh, pagdadala ng mga gamit namin sa susunod naman na, naming lilipatan cover din yon or shoulder din yon ng office nila ni Api. So, yung part lang namin is kailangan namin maghanap ng kung saan yung gusto namin a flat or apartment, kung saan namin feel na area. Yun yung part namin, yung paghanap ng flat. Pero yung pagbabayad, yung ano na nila ni Api, yung office na nila. And then yung deposit. So, yun. Na-mention ko na to sa mga previous naming video, but I guess yung mga nagko-comment regarding sa pagrenta ng bahay, kanon, sa iba na mga bago lang dito sa aming channel na siguro hindi pa nila napanood yung mga uh, previous naming video kung saan na sabi ko na din um, regarding sa aming renta sa bahay. So, as long as nasa trabaho si Abby niya, kung saan siya nagtatrabaho ngayon, wala kaming pinoproblema sa renta sa bahay. Medyo napahaba na yung aking explanation, but anyway, I hope na kahit pa paano medyo na-inform kayo sa buhay-buhay namin dito sa India. And maraming salamat ulit sa inyong palaging panonood. And maraming salamat sa inyong mga magagandang comments na ano, nakakataba ng puso. Maraming salamat. So this is it for today's vlog. Si Mishka ay tulog si Abina sa kabilang kwarto nagbabasa. If you like our video, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to click the bell button so you will be notified if we have new video. And follow us on our Facebook and Instagram account, JN and Abhi. Good night and see you on our next vlog.